showdown at SoFi with the Cincinnati Bengals. This was an awesome night. After six straight losses to the San Francisco 49ers, the Rams win when it absolutely counted. Good evening. I'm Christine Devine. And I'm Alex Michelson, and I'm proud to be wearing my Rams hat tonight. So the Rams playing Super Bowl 56 in their home stadium, just the second time that's ever happened, and it worked out for the Bucks last year. We have team coverage of today's win over the 49ers. Phil Schumann and Coco McAvoy have reaction from the fans at SoFi at Zendejas in San Dimas. Hal Eisner has all the championship game merch. We begin with Kyle Kraska still live there at SoFi. Kyle. Not sure if, not sure if uh, Kyle can hear us. Let's start off with Phil. Take it away. Alex, Christine, nothing is more exciting than to see loyal sports fans like the Rams fans rewarded when their team wins a big game. There's only one game that will be bigger than today, and that, of course, is the Super Bowl two weeks from today. This was the scene outside the Rams uh, stadium after the game ended. Let's go, Rams! Seventy thousand spilled out of SoFi this afternoon. Honestly, it was evenly split between Rams fans and 49ers fans. Fans, there was a lot of red in the crowd today. But the Rams came from ten back. They never panicked. The fans never panicked, and now they're rewarded with a trip to the Super Bowl. And we start off talking with fans with perhaps the man that defines the term super fan. Everything. They are everything to me, from my ring to my watch to my shoes to my, 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 my socks, everything. When we get on the edge like that, it's like nerve-wracking, you know, you're scratching your head and everything, you know, and they're just sending you through the motions. I feel like uh, our defense wasn't really stepping up the first, uh, first half of the game. I feel like they could have did a little better. Um, they came through with some big plays at the end, you know, cleaned it up real nice. Oh, All the yes, way out here from Arizona, die-hard Rams fan. Yeah. Brought up with that L.A. Rams lifestyle, baby. Well, you were rewarded now with a victory. Heck yeah. Close game. You know, you got to give it up to the Rams. They, they closed it out strong. Hurts, but, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll be cheering for them in, a, in the Super Bowl. Well, that's a good sport, being Absolutely. a good sport. Absolutely. It was an exciting afternoon. So far, of course, the energy was just through the artificial roof. The... Um, Noise was so loud, Ellis. You can't even imagine what it's like in there. Now, yes, everyone was required to wear masks. They gave out the KN95s, but nobody was talking about COVID. Nobody was really thinking about COVID. The good news is cases are down and enforcement of the mask mandate. Let's just say uh, it was sporadic at best. So now, we have two weeks of a huge buildup. I think uh, you heard Kyle mention it briefly. We're already checking tickets on the secondary market. The uh, upper, upper, upper level approaching $6,000. Wow. Hard to believe. Live at SoFi, I'm Phil Schumann. More from the fans at 1030.